This is an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar on media compression in Adobe Media Encoder. Hi, my name is Larry Jordan. In this short video, I'll show you how to create watch folders to automate media compression. A watch folder is a folder. I'm going to create it in the Finder. You can create it anywhere you want. I generally create them somewhere obvious. Drop to create 720p. A watch folder is a folder that exists in the Finder that AME watches. I'm going to click the watch folder and it says to add a watch folder, click the add folder. I'm just going to drag it in. Ta-da! It now created a watch folder. And I want to have it automatically compress for 720p. Now I keep using the YouTube 720 because all the social media compression settings are the same. I'm using it simply as a placeholder. You can use any other compression setting. It works the same way. And so now the watch folder is watching. And notice here, auto encodes watch folders, which means when a file's dropped into the watch folder, AME is going to process it. So let me just grab the media folder. And I'm going to grab, what should I look at? We haven't, we need to see more of that train. So I'm going to drag that over and go back to AME and just watch. Oh, there it goes, compressing the file, and it's done. I didn't have to click any buttons. AME just watched the drop folder and it said, ah, there's something there. Open that up and it creates two other folders. The source file is moved to the source folder, so the source file is never damaged. And the output file is put here, and there is our compressed file. Is that not cool? That is cool. The power of a watch folder is that if AME is running, all you have to do is to drop a file into the watch folder, and AME will process it. In fact, you could even have it grab a file in, when it shows up in source and process it again. So you could have it pass through the first time and burn in watermarks and then process it a second time and create all the different versions you need for posting to the web. There's nothing that prevents adding folders inside the drop folder to AME. Very, very flexible. This was an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar. For the complete version of this presentation, please visit our store at larryjordan.com slash store and look for Webinar 299. By the way, when you need to stretch your training dollars, membership in our video training library saves you money and time. You can access all of our videos for a low monthly price of only $19.99. That's more than 1,900 movies on a wide variety of subjects. Plus, premium members can download practice media and projects. Our training covers Apple and Adobe software. We update it multiple times each month. And for more information, visit LarryJordan.com slash membership. And thanks.